welcome again guys in my youtube channel technical fantasy and uh, in this tutorial i am going to address some hidden features of samsung android mobiles i will explain seven features in this and uh, next seven features i will again uh, if, the, if this video is not too long i will address all 13 14 features in this uh, video but if the video is going long then i will make in into two parts so before proceeding i would like to request you that please subscribe this channel this is a new channel and needs your support so not wasting much your time let us come on the tutorial so first i will address if anyone want to see the battery percentage here then what he has to do is just go to the settings then search then search battery then the battery will come here uh, in uh, drop down uh, we, here when you can see that so battery percentage we have to click this and there are three options so here it is written so battery percentage just tap it on now we can see here that 27% battery has arrived so this is the first hidden feature so now I will come to second uh, thing that is side key the role of the side key if we press a double single press this key it will uh, the display will, will turn uh, uh, off and off not it will go into the sleep mode and black so if we double press this what will happen so to know the functions of the side key just go to the setting here search side key now we can see side key is there tap on this if we double press is on so if we now double press this it will launch camera means see I have pressed this two times and camera is now coming so going back if I can change this to any app I can open any app by just pressing that side key two times in a very short interval so here we can select any app that is Arup Kesetu, Instagram, Facebook, any GPay, any app you can select. So suppose here calculator is selected. Now if I am pressing this two times, then calculator will open. I will again set into the launch camera. Now if I am pressing two times side key, the camera will open. So this is about the side key next feature i will tell you about the navigation type so here uh, we are seeing there three vertical lines then one uh, square and then one arrow key if we want to change this navigation bar or type so what we have to do just go to settings search navigation navy navigation type is coming Here we can see that navigate but, uh, buttons are like that only. We can, if I am, I, because I am right handed, so I have selected this arrow key. If anybody is left handed and he is comfortable with doing arrow key and uh, doing all the things with left hand, then he can select this. Now full screen gestures, the gestures can be changed to full screens. Now what will happen? gesture hints and so side uh, so buttons to hide keyboard will also come now what if we want to slightly shift the all the tabs will come here all the tabs will come here okay just uh, press there and it will come we can go this way or this way to going forward and backward we can just swipe 
forward or swipe backward so this is all about navigation bar now i'm going back to the original because i'm right handed so this is about navigation type next feature i'm going to talk about the clock style suppose uh, here I, we are seeing that clock style is this one so if we want to change what we can to do we can do what we need to do we can do yes we search clock going on setting then search clock here we can see clock style has come then here clock style is there from here we can select any type of uh, clock style which we want to retain in our display analog as well as digital here we can change from there we can also change the colors black blue red any type of color hair type so this is then done button now it has done it will come like that only so this is all about the clock style next feature i want to uh, cover uh, is uh, device care for optimizing performance if it gets uh, if it is getting slow so how will we do that just go to the setting search device care here, here it is now here uh, we are seeing that uh, all is good battery storage memory security if we want to optimize data sharing ultra data sharing mode then we can also enable it from here so here it is coming optimized now if we optimize now if we press it then this device will be optimized by the inherent softwares which are reciting into our samsung mobile so now done now the battery now the performance of the phone will surely increased by certain extent so this is about the device k now i will talk to one uh, feature dual messenger suppose we have only one phone and uh, with a dual sim card samsung phone and we want to use uh, two facebook accounts we want to use two whatsapp accounts we want to use two telegram accounts in the same phone then what we need to do just we go to the setting and here we will type search dual dual messenger here dual messenger now we will go to the dual messenger here we are seeing there are four apps in which dual messenger can be used if we tap on any app so we will ask should it install a second copy of facebook we can install it and we can log in by the second account and we can use it so just like that we can install whatsapp we can log in by the second account of whatsapp so by telegram messengers these four apps can be used by this dual messenger used we can use two whatsapp accounts two facebook accounts two telegram accounts by this feature so this is all about dual messenger feature so guys the video is getting longer so i will uh, cover uh, next six seven uh, hidden features which i want to tell you in the next video that will be come very soon thank you guys thank you very much please if you like this video please share with your friends on the social media platform and uh, please subscribe this channel thank you thank you very much